Hello and welcome to our Treble D Studio House series. In these tutorials we'll be showing you how to quickly create a professional 3D SketchUp model for a modern house. In this video we'll demonstrate how to create light and space inside the home while also creating visual interest from both inside and outside. We're now looking at the upper floor bedroom on level 2. I'd like to create a high ceiling to allow for a ceiling fan and I'm going to put in some highlight windows. This will be a theme that's repeated throughout the house. So we open up the shell and using the push-pull tool we lift up the wall and type in 1500 or 5 feet and do the same for the rest of the bedroom walls. Now I'll import this window from the component browser which is a 600 by 1800 which is 2 foot by 6 foot and we move it into place. Now make two copies and adjust the size of the copies to suit the sliding door below. Now I'm going to lift them up 300 or 1 foot. Now in the Entity Info box we assign the new windows to the layer Doors and Windows. Now we make a copy of all three because we're going to use them again in the studio and the dining room. Now we head down to the studio and lift the walls up 1500 or 5 feet and we just have to double click the push pull tool. I'm actually going to get rid of this fireplace because we don't need it. Now we just paste the highlight windows in the shells layer. And move them into place. And I'm going to put another set of windows at the back of the studio over the garage roof. Now we just hop over to the dining room and do the same thing. Lift up the wall. It's going to give us space for a light fitting over the dining table. And we paste in the highlight window. We just need to adjust the copy to fit the smaller room. I'd also like to change this chimney slightly. I'd like to push it out from the wall to accentuate the indoor-outdoor feature of the stone and it will also tie the design in with the eave treatment that we're going to use to protect this window. So I'll just pull out the chimney 450 or 18 inches. You also need to extend the chimney up through the roof so we make a copy of it, go up to level 2 and open that group. Now paste in place, then we move it up to the floor level. Now we just need to adjust the chimney height. Because it's a component, if we adjust the height, we'll also adjust the height of the lower one, which we don't want to do, so we'll select, right click, and choose make unique. Then lift up the chimney to the top of the wall. Now we lift it up a further 1200 or 4 feet to allow for the roof. Now we're just going to put in a panel of glass in the stairwell here which will provide an outlook onto the pool as we walk down the stairs.
So it's all looking good. Please join us in the next tutorial where we'll explode the windows. If it's all too hard or if you just don't have the time, please feel free to contact us at Treble B. We have very modestly priced consultants who can help you out with construction drawings or any aspect of the design process. Cheers.